Hello everyone and welcome back. It's your girl Marquita with Marquita LV Luxury. On today, we will go over part two of my SLG collection. I'm so excited. Part one is already up and loaded, so let's get started. The first item I am going over is the Zippy Wallet. This is the reverse monogram Zippy Wallet. I purchased this to go with my on-the-go tote reverse monogram and also the Speedy 30 reverse monogram. And let's get this beauty open and see what's inside. I have not actually used this product, just being honest with you guys. I kind of start loving the reverse monogram card holder over this. For me, this is kind of too big, but I love having it in my collection just in case I do want to use it. This slot that's behind the card holders is usually used for cash or to hold checks. Here, it holds four cards here and four cards over there. And if you actually turn it around, you do have the same four cards here, four cards here, and another open slot as stated to hold cash or checks. You also have a mid compartment to where it does have a secure zipper holder for, I would say, coins. Or if you do decide to put cash in here, you can as well. And right next to it, it does have another open slot for cash or checks. So this does hold a ton for those that have more than, I would say, eight to 10 credit cards. This will be the perfect Zippy wallet for you. If you have cash and checks, this will be perfect. The next item I want to go over is the Demiri Bean Braza wallet. This was actually one of my favorites. Inside, I do have it hot stamped. And of course, it comes with plenty of slots for your card. On this side, it has eight slots. And on the opposite side, I believe it has six. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It has eight as well. So just right here with this wallet, it has slots for 16 cards. You also can put your driver's license here, which is very secure. And as you can see, I do have it high stamped. Behind the first card slot is an open area to where you can put receipts, cash, or checks. And it also has another opening following right behind it. On the opposite side, it does share the same, but it only has one open slot compartment for cash, checks, or receipts. And immediately following behind it, it has a secure zipper wallet opening here to where you can hold your cash. Or if you decide to put um, coins in here, you can as well. Behind the zipper, it is another slot opening to where you can hold cards, cash, or receipts. And then you have one more. As you can see, I do have receipts and I do have my cash deposit slips there as well. So I have used this when I first actually bought this, I used it to go with my graceful PM until I received the rectal card holder. So this does hold a ton and this is the browser wallet and unfortunately it is discontinued in this print. It is available on the website in the monogram print, but the Demir Bean has been discontinued. The next Zippy Wallet is most definitely one of my favorites. This was released in 2021 this year, and it is so much you can actually do with this Zippy Wallet because it's not only a Zippy Wallet, it can be converted into a crossbody or a shoulder bag. Depends on how you love to wear it. As you can see, it does have D-rings here, meaning you can attach any strap that you want here is a push open closure. It does have a beautiful black microfiber material. And here, you know, of course, your phone. Look at the shape, it's designed for a phone, but you most definitely can put whatever you wish in this open slot, but it's perfect for a phone as it is when you wear a crossbody, easy in and out access. So let's get this closed and let's get this beauty unzipped and open. Inside, very beautiful. My favorite part is the mid section. I am loving the reverse monogram inside. On the side, it does have an area for four cards here. 
And behind the card slot, it is an open area for cash, checks, or receipts. And it does have room here as well. We can't forget this midsection area to where you can hold items if you like. On the opposite side, it most definitely shares the same, but it doesn't have that open, that open slot to where it holds cash or cards, where it holds cash or checks, I'm sorry. Um, but you can actually put it right here as well. But it does hold cards. And as you can see, it holds four cards. And this midsection, inside I do have the chain strap the LV chain strap that comes with the bag. And this most definitely can be used for cash. And it also can be used for cards, coins, just whatever you prefer and whatever um, you like to carry, guys. So some people do not like to carry cash. Some only believe in carrying cards. So it's totally up to you. But this is very, very roomy and holds a lot. Plus, it has an area to hold your phone. So this is a win-win situation. So... Let's get this attached and I will show you how this looks as a crossbody and then we will continue on to the rest of the SLGs. Chain strap is on. It is not adjustable. So I will show you guys how it looks as a crossbody. And here it is as a crossbody. As you can see, as a crossbody and guys, it's right here to my hip. So if I do need to get my phone out, easy access. Or if you have cash that you want to put inside, you most definitely can do that as well. But as stated, easy access and easy closure. And if I do want to take something out as far as cash, I can most definitely do this, take it off, or you can keep it on and take whatever you need out. So I think this was very, very creative, very cute. And I am so glad to have it in my collection. But you guys know I am a crossbody fan on mostly all of my bags with a strap. Here it is. And you guys know I do change out the strap, so I most definitely will have a pochette motif strap on. I do have this on my page on Instagram. Okay, we have more SLGs to show. Let's keep moving. The next SLGs we will discuss is the Zippy Coin Purse. This was my first SLG. This was my first time dabbing into the SLG addiction, and I wore this baby out. I mean, as you can see, <laughs> I wore this baby out. Um, inside, perfect. Um, so many car slot openings here, and I stuffed this baby with so much, guys. I used to roll up my cash and put it here. So you have a slot opening here for cars. So that's one, two, three, and you also can fit some here. And in the midsection area, if you turn it over, it also has a card slot here. Okay. And on the same, on the opposite side, it shares the same. You can put one, two, three, and four. So this baby does hold a lot, as you can see. I absolutely was in love with this coin purse. Guys, I had coins in here, I had cash. I was just so happy to have an SLG to match a bag. And so this was my first, this is the Zippy coin purse. And my second one, of course, is the beautiful bicolor Zippy coin purse here. And it actually is the exact same. On this side, it has one, two, and three. So it'll probably be hold one, let's see, two, three and then four and in the middle the same a card slot opening and on the opposite side one two three and four very very beautiful i have not used this beauty yet um i was too busy using the uh mini pochette in place of this but this is a beautiful beautiful zippy coin purse that goes with all of my other bicolor items so I was so happy to add this beauty to my collection. Okay, let's keep going guys, I have more to show. 
The next SLG is the Victorine Wallet. I have it in the bicolor in the Turtle Dove and cream. So it's cream, and I believe the color that's embossed in the monogram um, is Turtle Dove. If I'm if I'm wrong, I do apologize. But um, this is the bicolor and the black on front leather Victorine Wallet. And let's get one of these beauties open first. Let's go with this one. And another beautiful, beautiful card holder, which holds one, two, and three. And on the opposite side, it holds one, two, and three. Behind it is an area also for cards. And also on the opposite side. So both have openings for cards. So I will say three and that's six. And you also, it depends on how many cards you wanna put behind here. So I would say it holds, what, 10? It just depends on if you wanna put two cards here or if you wanna put one. It just, like I said, it's totally up to you. So that's three and that's six. And then you can put seven and eight or you can put two and two. Like I said, it's totally up to you. It does have a back slot opening, which is for cash, checks, or receipts. And then it also comes with a zipper to be used for coins. So, so beautiful. And I hate I didn't get this hot stamped. Oh, I love having my items hot stamped. I'm gonna start having my daughter's initials hot stamped in some of these items as well. So this is the Victorine wallet in the bicolor. And let's move on to the black on front Victorine. And let's get this beauty really open. And it's basically the exact same thing. Three card slots, three card slots, and card slots behind. For your cash, checks, or receipts, and for coins. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love having both of these in my collections. I love the Victorine Wallet so much. And if you do have the Victorine Wallet, let me know in the comments because I really, really, really fell in love with this black on front. The next wallet, of course, which was my absolute favorite, the Juliet Wallet. I have a recent review on this and I also have a review that I did a year ago um, when I first purchased, it is in the beautiful reverse monogram print. And also it has the black leather fixtures as well. And I'm loving the circle monogram that's here on the closure latch button closure right here in the front. This is usually where I kept my driver's license here. And look at this beautiful reverse monogram print. This is so, so gorgeous. Opening up, you immediately right here have one, two, three, four card slot opening. And as you see, I do have a card back here. You do have um, additional room for more cards. So as you can see, I have one card back here. So more cards can fit. Okay, guys. And once I turn it over, this right here is another compartment very very roomy to where it does hold additional cards if you like or you can put coins in here it does not have any card slots but it is roomy if you do want to fit cards or if you do want to add coins totally up to you but i am loving the reverse monogram inside with the black very very carefree so you have your card slots here Additional room here. I would have loved if they did make an opening here for more cards, but that's totally fine. Turn it over. As stated, it does have a zipper closure for additional cards or coins, or if you want to fold your cash, or you can put your cash in the back open slot area. So you have an opening for, call, for um, cash, checks or receipts it just totally depends on you and what you like to carry okay so this to me is the perfect perfect wallet um like i said i wore this out <laughs> i wore this out so beautiful and it was so hard to get and i think it is still now since they hard to get so very beautiful 
as stated, a button closure. Very, very carefree. The next two SLGs are actually my favorite, the six key ring holder and also the four key ring holder. A lot of you guys ask, why do I have both? This is for my business, for my location, and this is my personal for my key fob, me and my husband key fobs and the house keys. So I love to keep everything separate. You can see I have two key fobs and house keys here. Okay, so my husband's key fob and my key fob. And my business location keys and the mailbox. And so guys, if you do have these, do you guys keep anything behind here? Like this is what actually came, this is just the information. But do you guys put anything back here? I just don't feel like it's so it's secure enough, but I have seen people say that they have put cards back here. If they want to just, you know, go into the store, they put cards or cash. But for me, it's, it's not secure enough, even if you do have it closed. I don't know. For me, I just like to stay safe. And for me, I just don't see it happening. But if you do, let me know. But it is opening back here for a reason. Okay, and the next two SLGs um, is another card holder. This is Rose Ballerine Pink, and this is the one in the black. I love both of these so much, and at the present moment, I am using this one. So this is the Rose Ballerine Pink and Monogram. And as you can see, I do have items in here, and mostly business cards. Okay, so it has one, one, two, three, four, and five. So I will say it holds, because this is a very, very large area, um, roomy area, I would say you can hold at least three to four inside. And let me see. I'm going to see how many, because I actually have my other one super, super stuffed. So in this one card slot, I have one, two, three, four cards here. Okay. So it does hold a lot. And this is the Rose Ballerine Pink and the Monogram with a button closure. Absolutely love this card holder. And at the moment, as stated, this is what I'm currently using. Button closure, and it is loaded. <laughs> I have business cards, my debit cards, credit cards, everything inside. So that will let you know that, hey, this is in my top, I would say five SLGs, and I have been using this for what, four days now. So convenient. You can actually open it up and see exactly what card you need. I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so now we are going to move on to the bigger SLG that's in my collection. And I am going to start with the cosmetic bag from the Game On Collection. Gold hardware and Vachetta tabs, which actually has so much makeup and oil <laughs> on them, but hey, that's what it is made for. I don't know why they put Vachetta on cosmetic bags. That's just a big no-no LV, but hey, you done it. It's here. And gold hardware, as stated, gold zipper. And inside, this thing is totally damaged. <laughs> inside, it is totally damaged. Um, it does come with a back opening. I'm not sure for what, what reason, but it does have a back open slot here. And like I said, I do have some lip gloss and all kinds of things in here. As you can see, it's makeup all inside, but that's what a cosmetic bag is for. And so uh, this is from the Game On collection. Absolutely love. And I do take this with when I do travel. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you the matching toiletry. 
that goes with it. I actually got these two together. So when I do decide to travel, these two are paired together. So this is the Toiletry 26 from the Game On Collection. And a Vachetta end tab inside. Looks very, very nice and clean. And I have used this before, so I guess I was just that, that careful. So I love having these two beautiful, beautiful travel pieces when I do travel. They're just gorgeous. Okay, the next cosmetic bag that I have in my collection is my absolute favorite, the red unprunt leather cosmetic bag. As you guys can see, it is embossed in a beautiful monogram. No vachetta at all. So, so beautiful. And this was so hard to get, guys. This was so hard to get. I was so happy that my CA was able to snag this for me. This beautiful red gold hardware. Let's get this beautiful cosmetic bag open. And inside, I am very, very careful with this cosmetic bag. Um, the Game On cosmetic bag is already, hey, inside has a lot of what makeup marks, lipstick marks, but I just want to keep this so beautiful and clean inside because it's so gorgeous. And it does have that back slot opening as well. Like I said, I'm not sure why. But I guess some people use it as a clutch and they can put their cards back here. I'm not sure, but I use it as a cosmetic bag. And paired with the cosmetic bag, if you see me with a cosmetic bag, I'm going to always have a toiletry to match. And of course, I do. Here is the beautiful red unprint toiletry 26. And look at this combo, guys. This is gorgeous. And this is heavy, so I have something inside. <laughs> I'm not sure what it is. Um, yeah, a bar of soap. So, guys, you know when I travel, I bring my own soap. I bring my own shampoo. I bring everything. I do not like using the hotel, uh, the hotel soap. So, I do have soap inside, and it does have a back opening, as stated, because you can convert. I know a lot of people do not agree with converting the toiletry 26, but I'm with those that convert. <laughs> I mean, get the best out of the bags, guys. Whatever you wanna do with your bag, do it. You also can wear this beautiful, beautiful toiletry 26 as a clutch, as I see a lot of women do. So it does have an opening inside for your cards. So, Having these two together was truly a blessing to have. So this is the cosmetic, the cosmetic pouch in the unprint um, red and the toiletry 26 in the unprint um, red. Okay, so now let's move on to the Kirigami sets that I have. Next SLGs I would like to go over is the Kirigami sets. These beauties were so hard to get when they first came out and they're actually still hard to get now. I'm not sure if they're discontinued or not, but I'm pretty sure that they are. If the Toiletry 26 is discontinued, they probably have these discontinued as well. And I'm starting to notice anything that we try to convert, LV wants to get rid of it. To me, it's strange. I would think that it actually makes the market go up for that item. More people will try to purchase but for some reason, anything that we try to change and convert, they get rid of it. But here it is. This is the smaller, um, the smaller Kirigami here. And the mid-size and the larger Kirigami. And it does come at a, as a set. And if you are trying to purchase this now in the pre-love market, they are actually selling these individually and they are sky high. They are marking these babies up. I have seen it. So if you can catch the set together, <laughs> I'm not sure how much it will be now if it's not on the LV website, but they are marking these babies up. Totally, hey, if that's how they rock, <laughs> you gotta roll with it. So here is the Kirigami set. The smaller one is here, the beautiful interior. And inside, of course, I do already have and insert inside. This is from Swag My Bags. I will leave that link below in the description box. It does have a D-ring 
here to where you can attach a chain strap. You can wear it um, on your belt loop. You can just basically wear it and convert it. You can have this on any type of way. And here it is. And let's take this beauty out. And I actually do have two. If you do want to have it on as a small crossbody, you most definitely can. And the middle is here, the beautiful red interior. And of course, it does have an insert inside. This beautiful Kirigami holds so much. I have seen this worn as a clutch as well. On the arm, you can wear this as a little small wallet. It can also go in as a mini pochette as well. You can also turn these into a travel piece. If you do not have the toiletry 15 or 19, this most definitely can take the place of it. It just doesn't have the zipper. It just has the button closure. And here is the larger Kirigami, and this most definitely has been used as a clutch and converted. I do have a video on this, and this can be converted as well into a crossbody. This is a very, very nice size Kirigami. So if you do not have the Toiletry 26, you can most definitely try to use this as a travel piece as well. Button closure, the beautiful rose ballerine pink inside. And of course, I do have an insert. There it is. And this holds, it holds quite a bit, guys. It holds quite a bit. It can hold your key fob. It can hold your wallet. And like I said, I did do a video on this to show exactly what the Kirigami holds. And the smaller Kirigami most definitely is used as a card holder. So you do not have to have the insert inside. It does not come with an insert. So you can just use this as a card holder. I love this set so much. I would not trade it. I would not sell these. These are most definitely a prized piece to have in your collection. Now, let's move on. I do have another Kirigami set that I would like to go over. Next Kirigami set is from By The Pool Collection. I love this. I just think it's so creative. Perfect for the summertime, the spring. You can most definitely wear these individual. I just think these are some beautiful colors just to have in your collection. Again, this is the smaller one used for a card holder. And if you need something to take the place of, I would say the toiletry 15. I have the toiletry 19, let's see. So I would say the 15. If you need something to replace the toiletry 15, this most definitely can. And of course, I do have an insert inside. Very, very beautiful. Look at these colors. Button closure. And so if you did get the Kirigami set from By The Pool Collection, let me know in the comments. So cute, so creative, so different. I love this. So the smaller and the midsize and of course the large, I have the never full mm bag that matches this i most definitely use it i do not have a pochette to go with this collection so this most definitely took the place so i actually put this inside of the neverfull and it was so beautiful i received so many compliments on that neverfull bag from by the pool collection um i do have it on instagram i believe i do have it on instagram i did take a picture in it the colors are just banging so cute so summertime and let's get this open beautiful pink interior and there it is. such a lovely piece and like i said this can be converted as well clutch or a crossbody 
Okay, we have a few more SLGs to go over and then we are absolutely done. I am going to go over my entire toiletry collection and then I'm going to move on to one item that I received last year for Christmas from my CA and then that does wrap up the SLG collection. Okay, the first toiletry we will go over is of course the monogram canvas. This is the toiletry 26 and as you see I do have a convert kit inside and I do have a chain strap attached. Guys, convert as much as you want. Any bag that you want to convert, do so. I am going to wear this as a crossbody, a shoulder bag. I am going to wear it as a clutch. And I'm also going to use it as a toiletry whenever needed. So, guys, it's no right or wrong way to wear and adjust and convert your bags, okay? The inside, as you can see, I have used this as a toiletry. It does have some... Some scuff marks inside but I do like I said I have a insert inside to convert into a handbag I'm going to zip it does have a vachetta tab here as you can see it has all kind of oil spots because I actually do use this when I do travel and I know this isn't this type of video, but I will go ahead and show you guys. This is how it looks as a crossbody. And like I said, the strap is kind of long. I usually like mine at my hip, but here it is. As a shoulder bag. And as a clutch. And I'll still keep that chain strap on because it just looks cute. <laughs> Probably a shorter chain, but I'll most definitely keep it on and just have it as a clutch. And you also can change the strap out. You know, I am a fan of the monogram pochette. Matisse strap, so I will probably use probably the reverse strap just to add some spice to it, change it up. But this is the first toiletry 26 in the monogram print. The next toiletry I would like to discuss is from the Wild at Heart collection. This toiletry 26 here is absolutely gorgeous. Very gorgeous, very creative. A lot of people did not like this collection. I did not go all out. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of the Wild at Heart collection as well, but this one, I just could not pass up a toiletry 26. It was 2026 was discontinued. So I wanted to collect as many as possible. As stated, I wasn't a fan of this collection, but I did grab the 2026 because I knew it was going to be leaving us soon. So here it is inside black interior. And I love how they just reverse the sides, the colors. So gorgeous. I believe this came in a black and pink as well. Okay, the next toiletry, 26, is in the unprint material, the unprint leather. And this most definitely is a gorgeous piece as well. Here is the inside. Beautiful colors together. And I actually converted this as well on Instagram. Here's a picture here. So I love the Toiletry 26. I do, I love it so much. Okay, and here is the next Toiletry we already previously discussed. This is the from the Game On collection. Another Toiletry 26. Very different, very cute, and a lot of people didn't like this collection at all either but I was such a huge fan. And my favorite, we already discussed this as well. This is the red umfront. And this beautiful piece is quite different. It has a side slot opening and the other toiletry 26 do not, as you can see. 
okay so that is a difference but like i said i'm so blessed i was able to snag this beauty here and i believe it came out in blue like a dark navy blue as well okay and the last 2226 i would like to go over is the size 19. i did not purchase the 15 because i was just so stuck on my mini pochette i was like hey they're the same size but now that they're discontinued i am kicking myself in the butt i do see them in the pre-loved market but they are sky high and i just love my products to be new i love doing the unboxing i love the fresh smell of just it being new so um i do not want to order or buy from the pre-loved market i have nothing against the pre-loved market but for the toiletry i want to be the only and the first to use it um I believe these items are still out there to where you can order. I guess it just depends on a CA. If they can reach it for me, the 15 isn't a big deal. Um, I went for the 19. So happy to have this. Um, inside is roomy as well. And you can convert this into being a smaller crossbody if you like. It does have a Vachetta tab here, gold hardware. But this is just like a small quick store run clutch as well so you can actually put this inside as well to put items in like your key fob you can have your cards in here a lot of things can fit inside of this 19 to where you can just grab and go okay guys the last slg i saved for last because i hold it so dear to heart this was a christmas gift last year from my beautiful beautiful ca this is the reverse monogram trunk she knows i love 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 reverse so much and i believe this was just so so sweet of her to gift me with and so this is a small reverse as stated monogram trunk it does have a push open access oh so cute and inside it does have a slide for cards so I would basically say this is probably like a, a wallet or a card holder. You can put cash in here, coins, whatever you like. And this is so, so beautiful. And I am so happy and so thankful that she thought of me. Ah, so gorgeous. And the black leather trimming, no Vachetta. This is a carefree item. So cute. And I do still have the plastic on the gold hardware. And as you can see here, oh, it can be like a little, a little wristlet as well. So cute. You can hold your key fobs in here. You can put your cards, like I said, checks, cash, coins, whatever. This is, this is adorable. You can actually hook it on to another bag as well. It will be quite a big, large piece to attach to a bag, but you most definitely can attach it to a handbag if you like. But I will use it as a wristlet. And just put my key fob cards inside. Okay, guys, that does wrap up my entire, entire SLG collection. As stated, I have 54 SLGs in my collection that I am so happy and so blessed to have. Guys, let me know in the comments how many SLGs do you have in total. Thank you guys for tuning in. This is part two. Part one was loaded yesterday, so this is part two. Let me know in the comments how you guys feel. What SLGs do we have alike? How many SLGs do we have alike? Thank you guys once again for tuning in. As always, stay safe and stay blessed and happy holidays. Bye-bye.